Irene Van Dyke comes with a great deal of experience, having played for both South Africa and New Zealand between 1994 and 2011, South Africa 72 times, and New Zealand 145 times a national record. Now she is in Trinidad to help our netball as part of the Government of New Zealand's initiative. This country, along with Barbados and Jamaica, have been selected as the target countries. Trinidad and Tobago Netball President Dr. Patricia Butcher is understandably elated as she cited the benefits of having Mrs. Van Dyke in this country. We share outstanding netball histories, having been joint winners of the Netball World Cup, which was held here in Trinidad in 1979. What a pleasant memory that is for us, and we will be celebrating our 40th year next year. It has the potential to promote long-standing netball connections and to share our sporting values. She added, the visit of Mrs. Van Dyke will lift the local game to a higher level. She adds, the TTNA is turning its focus on coaching and umpiring. I expect that you will use the knowledge gained in the further development of the sport, especially at the foundation levels, in the primary schools and secondary schools. That's where we have to build the foundation. And the lady of the moment, Irene Van Dyke, shared what she has in store for the next three days. And if you think you were just going to sit back and relax today, no, it's not going to happen. <laughs> because as you do your clinics and as you um, go through all these workshops you know the worst thing you can do is sit there for an hour and a half two hours and you're like <laughs> give it all asleep. so um, my workshops are very much um, interactive where we share ideas where we um, share our experiences the visit includes four coaching sessions and will end on friday Ian Wilson, Sea Sports Extra.